How's it going, everybody? So real quick, I want to show you how to practice run boosting all by yourself with the help of a bot. It's super simple, and it's a pretty fun mechanic to learn and practice. Nothing's more satisfying than hitting a cool run boost and actually getting kills off the back of it. I mean, what's the enemy player really supposed to do in this situation? So let's go ahead and jump right into it. So to practice run boosting with a bot, all you have to do is be in a practice server where you have SV underscore cheats enabled or set to true. And uh, if you want to know a good practice configuration, links in the description, I have a video on how to set all of that up. But let's talk about practicing with a bot. So the first step is you're going to want to add a bot to the server. And don't worry, you're not going to have to type all this out every time. I have a nice set of binds that you can set uh, to where you can just do simple key presses. But for the purpose of showing you what these com what the commands that we're doing, I'm going to be typing it out for this. I just know it'll be a little bit faster for you if you set up the binds. So first thing we're going to do, we're going to type in bot underscore add underscore CT. And as you can see, we have a new little bot friend right here in the server. Right after that, we're going to type in bot underscore stop space one. That way he doesn't shoot us whenever he sees us. And then we're going to look wherever we want him to spawn. And we're going to type in bot underscore place. And just like that, he's standing right here in front of us, just chilling, ready to practice run boosting. So at this point, the next thing you're going to want to do is type in bot underscore crouch space true. That way you can jump up on top of his head. Then you can jump back up there and type in bot underscore crouch space false, stand up. And just like that, you're on the bot's head, ready to practice run boosting. So the next command you want to type in is bot underscore mimic underscore yaw underscore offset space zero. By default, this is set to 180 um, so that whenever you type in bot underscore mimic space one to get him to mimic you, he's going to be doing the absolute opposite, which is definitely not good. So make sure you set this to zero. But once you type in bot underscore mimic space one, he's going to be right here and just walk and follow every single step that you make so that you're able to perfectly practice run boosting. For example, I can get set up right here on this generator. And uh, of course, you know, if you accidentally fall off, you can just type in bot underscore mimic space zero and you can jump back on top of his head and then just bot underscore mimic space one. And then just like that, he's ready to run boost. So let's go ahead and try to make the, uh, the notorious run boost here where you can just jump over here and make it all the way to this position and surprise the crap out of the CTs if they've pushed up and taken a lot of early space. Hey, assemble it again. Let's go. Oh, jump in the flash on top. It is so sick. Kyla with a double kill. Now, while that may have looked like a lot of confusing console commands and a lot of typing, I'm going to show you how quick this is once you get it bound. So I can hit the equal sign on my keyboard to add the bot. I can then press I to make him stop. I can press L to place him. I can press O to make him crouch. I can jump up. I forgot to turn off Mimic, but I can jump up on top of here, right? I can press uh, O again. I can press P and just like that, we're already ready to run boost. We're already ready to practice it. And I can just go right back around and make the jump yet again. Simple as that. And it's very, very easy to set up. So yeah, I hope this video helps you find new run boosts and practice and get down your movement better for these types of jumps because it's a lot of fun to try to pull off in game.